Welcome to Inside NAU, a show highlighting Northern Arizona University. I'm your host, Teresa Beer, outside the Keim Lab, which has been abuzz with topics of international interest. A paper was just released dealing with the antibiotic resistant superbacteria called MRSA. Paul Keim is a Regents professor and director of NAU's Center for Microbial Genetics and Genomics. He says he and his colleagues use DNA technology to identify pathogens and problems they pose, like in the case of MRSA. We think that this uh, bug was created in farm animals, it's in particular in pigs, that were being treated with antibiotics. And so we are now creating a new antibiotic-resistant bug or, or germ or bacterium that can infect humans. And so this type of scientific research should help inform the policy on how we use antibiotics in production of food. Keim says he works closely with other scientists on how science informs policy. His recent focus on the National Science Advisory Board for Biosecurity has been H5N1. This is a type of flu that only infects birds. It's an avian species but occasionally, very occasionally, it infects humans. And fortunately, it has a very high mortality rate when it does it. 60% of the people get infected with this virus die. And so we're very concerned about this emerging from nature and infecting people. And we're also very, uh, very cognizant of the fact that if we do experiments in the laboratory, we might inadvertently create something that's uh, a detriment to human populations as well. Prior to our interview, Keim had been at the World Health Organization in Geneva, meeting with other flu experts, discussing possible policies to govern potentially hazardous research. Regulation in these areas is a controversial idea, which Keim says needs to be balanced with protecting human populations from this scary virus. <laughs> 